Good evening and thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Martha Kowalski. And I'm Mike Thompson. A former Onalaska priest facing child pornography charges has died. Six-year-old father Patrick Umberger passed away today at an assisted living facility after a long battle with cancer. News 8's Lou Hillman has, joins us now with our top story at 10. Lou? Well, those who knew Father Umberger were not surprised to hear about his passing. They tell me he had been sick for a number of years and doctors recently discovered the cancer had come back. Now, Umberger had been at St. Patrick's Church since 2005. He resigned from his priest duties in July, however, after being arrested. According to court records, investigators found a number of sexual pictures of children on his computer. He was also investigated for allegedly acting suspicious at a Wisconsin Dells water park. There are mixed emotions tonight from those who knew him at his church. There's going to be a lot of questions that are unanswered, and, and for some people that's going to be very bothersome. For others, they're, like I said, they're, they're going to say, um, let's just let this go away. He was scheduled to go on trial next year. His attorney says the allegations took quite a toll on his client, but he says Umberger maintained his innocence until his death. To this point, literally to this point, we still had not seen any evidence to show that there was any pornography on his computer. The fact that he spent the last few months of his life dealing with this situation is, is really frustrating. Now, despite the allegations, both people I spoke with tonight did say there were a lot of people at St. Patrick's that have missed Father Umberger's presence at the church. Thanks a lot, Lou. Also, as of tonight, no funeral services have been set for Father Umberger.